Hello everyone, in today's video we shall learn how to do this text box with color effect in Notion and as usual I'm going to type down the code and towards the end of the video we shall test out the code to see if we made any mistakes or not. So let's get into it. So we are going to be using a new function and the function is f color box open a bracket and I, for this example I'm going to give let's say a salmon a color and I'm going to close the bracket and again open a color and put in lavender color so basically what this function does is it takes the first color that you're given it gives it to the outline and the second color is the fill so basically the first color is the outline and the second color is the fill so that's pretty much it so basically the color is sorted out and this is how you get the border and the fill color so the next thing that we need to focus on is the content inside the box so for that we obviously are going to use a function called substack and you can go ahead and open a bracket and put in a dollar sign so basically what dollar sign helps you do is it helps you to have multiple different lines one below the other without actually stacking one line on top of the other which is like an overlay effect from the previous videos that you have seen uh, so it doesn't do that but it helps you stack one line below the other uh, clearly uh, like in the example given so after the dollar sign is put you are going to use the stack substack function so go ahead and type that in and after this it's quite simple and straightforward so what you're going to be doing is use the function text over here you can put in any font of your choice you want to put math bb you can or a math bf or text sf or text bf uh, it's totally up to you um, it depends on what aesthetic you're going for so I'm going to keep it simple right here and use the plain text and inside here I'm going to type in hello basically you can type in any content that you want I'm going to go ahead and put in double backslash so that I go into the next line so over here also you want to put in a text basically if you have three four lines you want to keep uh, repeating uh, this part of the equation uh, including the double line because it has to go to the next line of course uh, so over here I shall write nice to meet you okay and I'll just go ahead and close the bracket and go to the next line uh, with double backslash and enter so I'm going to repeat this again and okay so I'm done so I'm going to stick to only three lines and after this is done we want to go ahead and trace back to see if we have any open brackets so this is paired really well this is pa also paired really well this is also paired really well so we only have this bracket so let's go ahead and close that as well and now since we had only this left within the substack and that is also closed so you want to close even dollar sign so we have to go ahead and type in a dollar sign there as well and once everything is done like basically from uh, year to year everything is done and we still have only like this bracket so let's go do that so this is basically the end of the equation so let's go ahead and test this out so I'm going to write in a random word and let's go ahead and copy this uh, code and paste it into this into an equation paste it right there and close so let's go ahead and um, make this slightly bigger so there you can see that it looks really really nice maybe you can change the salmon color perhaps let's do uh, corn flour blue okay there we go it looks so much nicer like the lavender and the corn flour blue actually matches uh, really well together so this is how you can um, 
create your own text box with color, uh, text effect in Notion and in case you want to change the uh, text you can do that as well so let's go ahead and do that uh, for fun do a sans serif font because why not sans serif and yeah alright so there we go we did that as well it's really fun and really cool to do that uh, so yeah I hope you learned something from this video and I will see you in the next one Bye.